architects came to Oatana, they met with a group of what, what they would consider kind of a um, consensus building or a um, group of uh, teachers, um, other staff, um, students, community members, and administration. And we all got together um, as a focus group to really start to say, what are those essentials, those things that you need to have in a school that are going to allow us to do the work that we do? And in that process, then they really started dividing out what are the priorities. And one of the priorities was centralized space where students can meet, um, connect with each other, um, and utilize as a cafeteria or a meeting space, things like that. And then from around there, they wanted to make sure that there were plenty of classrooms that were extremely flexible um, so that students could utilize them in the way that they need to learn. And so that that was kind of the theme that um, started to emerge around that and then it was also um, added into um, down by the athletic wing as well. So we'll have a ton of new technology that um, first of all will be communicative so um, there will be a lot of communication screens um, across the entire uh, school so in that way student announcements, um, opportunities for students to connect with colleges and things like that that um, they'll use as, as a communication tool. Yeah so we have a lot of teachers right now working on ways that they can innovate their classrooms so do they want to do some co-teaching um, where they can do um, on specific days, uh, workshop type style where they meet with individual groups of students to do some direct teaching. Um, also then some um, work away opportunities for students to work in clusters or in groups of um, students. And so really looking at dynamically how we want to use those spaces. So our hope and design of all of this was to make sure that first of all it allowed for spectators to have the, the best um, opportunity to interact with our activities um, and ensure that students had a very welcoming space to be there because that's truly um, what we're all about is making sure that we bring um, the, the opportunity for students to um, support and celebrate um, their teams. Not only in the football stadium but also then in uh, the gymnasium to have that opportunity for, uh, for students to be able to observe and have a a space that's theirs. Um, out on the football field I think you're gonna find the student section is huge. Um, it's a great location for that. We have not decided yet where the band is exactly going to go. We might still have them on the field so in that way there's interaction between the two and then that's where the the team will come out onto the field. Um, in the gym um, not only do we have the bleachers on both sides of the court but the ends of the court have bleachers too and so depending on our student population of how many students attend we might be able to utilize those for the band and for um, student sections too um, for cheering on our teams. So I think the design is very much so that um, students that are going to be there there to cheer on our teams are fully interactive and um, going to be engaged and right on the court uh, because that's where you should be um, cheering as loud as you can for the Huskies.